Hello coders, welcome to this new video. In this video, we will talk about the referral uh, system of Newton School. So how the placement uh, status is going on and uh, in right now it is uh, October. So almost for the batch uh, of uh, Gen, Feb, March, April. So students are getting referrals from Newton School according to their preferences, what the preferences they have uh, chosen in the placement tab. For example, work from home, uh, work from office, uh, location and uh, based on their project resume evaluation. So now students are getting referrals. So those students who are uh, uh, saying that uh, in Newton referrals is not going on. So those are wrong. That statements are not valid. I just want to show you the referral. Here you can see the referrals uh, company listed here. Okay. So uh, resume is... Uh, first uh, Newton is referring to the student for a specific company here you can see and after that if your resume is up to the mark according to the company then you will get the company in your dashboard as well and you have to be appear for the test as well so it's uh, there is no doubt that uh, students are getting referrals so there is a specific uh, you can say referral criteria because it's not uh, that uh, you will get the referrals by somehow you are not uh, reading you are not attentively working in newton school and you will get the referrals so it's an entire process just you have to wait for your turn and uh, also fulfill the criteria whatever the criteria newton is deciding for the referrals so must fulfill all the criteria for example in advanced batch the criteria set to all the challenge levels okay and in other batch, for example, uh, not in advanced DSA, the criteria is uh, uh, in DSA one, they are saying you must have to clear till hard or till medium in different different. I just I will show you the criteria as well in the end of the video. So students are thinking that they are not getting referrals, but there are different different scenarios. Uh, if uh, you are not filling the criteria, okay, uh, those students are not getting referrals. It's a uh, universal truth. So if you will fulfill the exact criteria, then Newton will refer you on a specific company on uh, this debt ABC company. Okay, I'm not going to uh, take the name of the companies. But yeah, referrals is uh, an ongoing process. It is totally dependent on our hard work, what... Uh, uh, how you are working, how you are submitting the assessment, how you are fulfilling the criteria of uh, Newton school, this, this, this things is based on. But also some students have the query that they are fulfilling all the criteria of Newton school, but still they are not getting referrals. So one major blocker is your, uh, I, I can say your resume evaluation. Your resume is not evaluated because uh, just now uh, Newton has shared a detail about uh, how you have to prepare your resume and special in the project section, just subdivide the entire project in f four bullet point. The first one is the features. The second one is about uh, just, uh, yeah, uh, the first one is the features and the second one is the tech stack that you are using. For example, if your project is uh, based on React, then your tech stack will be HTML, CSS, Bootstrap if it is and uh, react as well and uh, yeah this, these are the tech stack and in after tech stack you have to uh, mention your, your features of the project might be possible it will be a to-do list app just i'm giving you the example so it has crud operation that is create retrieve update delete apart from this uh, if your uh, project is responsive means it is uh, uh, applicable in different devices as well for the different screen then you have to mention that features as well and in the last you, uh, you have to mention the contribution as well so contribution also so case that uh, how much in-depth knowledge uh, you have about the project and how much you uh, your contribution in that specific project so uh, create the project like this and mention the things in the bullet that's why your resume will uh, get approval as soon as possible so these are the major blocker that is students are fulfilling all the criteria they have cleared all the mocks and all but still they are not getting the referrals just because their resume is not uh, approved apart from this and also there is a specific section uh, just i'm going for the placement tab so that you can know so let's suppose uh, yeah in uh, front end they are only uh, writing work from office so preferred job location will be work from office so right now uh, all the office uh, all the companies trying to get their employee back in office so if you are willing to work from home then uh, please edit your preferences as well preferred job roles front end back end 
and uh, uh, full stack development developer as well so if you are mentioning front end then in your resume might be possible there will be at least re react based project javascript html css is mandatory as well if you are going for the front end as well then you have at least uh, uh, i don't know you have at least node js project the redux based project as well if you are going with the full stack then you have at least uh, java based project if you are not f f uh, fulfilling this criteria and uh, you are listing that front end back end and uh, uh, full stack developer then it is not uh, uh, the way that you will get the referrals from newton school also if your minimum expected ctc that uh, uh, here uh, 7 lakh is mentioned if you are uh, willing that uh, i want 10 12 lpa so 10 12 lpa companies are less right now so if you are willing to uh, sit in only 12 lpa and you are mentioning then you also blocking the criteria of uh, company uh, company listing so if you have 12 lpa then all the companies which are below from 12 it will not showcasing in your dashboard if you guys want to sit in uh, here you can see my resume is also approved if you also uh, if you want to sit in let's suppose uh, 12 12 lpa company so must you have to fulfill all the criteria you must have to uh, mention here 7 so that from 7 to 12 lpa company will be listed in your dashboard because if you will stick to 12 only then if 12 lpa company will be there then only that company will be suitable for you and the uh, yeah and the selection process and the preferences process based on these specific things uh, in your dashboard companies will be there so keep your willing and keep your preferences according to the suitable scenarios and uh, if you are uh, going for 12 lpa if you want to sit only in 12 16 15 lpa company then it's very good but keep your minimum expected CTC low so that you will get the referrals at least. I think you are getting my point. So don't uh, go to the big amount. Just keep it as minimum as possible. I'm not saying that you uh, have to write 5 LP only. You have to write 6 LP only, not 12, not 13. So I'm not saying that. But at least keep your minimum expected CTC so that you will get at least referrals so that you have the choices but if you are keeping 7 then you will get 7 8 9 10 11 12 no doubt but if you directly mention 12 then might be possible only 12 uh, lpa company will be there and if it will be in newton school then newton will refer that company to your dashboard so i think you got the main behind the scene why you are not getting the referrals and also as uh, i told you earlier i will showcase you the criteria what the exact criteria for getting the referral so they are mentioning that uh, in dsa that is data structure and algorithm they want 30 score in uh, dsa section and in front end they want 45 so this is depend on in which batch you are if you are in uh, let's suppose advanced dsa batch then it is 100 percent sure you must have to clear all the mocks till challenge uh, means DSA 1 challenge, DSA 2 challenge, DSA 3 and 4 if possible then challenge okay as uh, you can see here in DSA 1 they are saying uh, challenge, DSA 2 challenge, DSA 3 and 4 hard or challenge and uh, web development uh, and uh, front end okay they are saying hard slash challenge and react hard slash challenge so keep in mind if you are in advanced DSA batch then uh, at least you have to clear all the challenge criteria for the mock and if you are in lower batch then uh, hard is uh, uh, the last thing at least you have to clear the hard so that you will get the referrals because newton just uh, uh, you can say uh, newton clear that uh, if you are clearing this criteria then might be possible in the company you will uh, perform very good very well that's why they are setting some specific crit criteria if you are fulfilling those criteria then uh, newton will allow you for sitting in the companies as well and also they are saying that all those labels along with uh, completing all your assignment will ensure you have raised this referral score so as uh, in this line they are saying that assignment uh, is also a mandatory criteria for getting the referral score apart from this you have also met uh, the non-tech stack requirement yeah and uh, according to the projects if i'm talking about the projects uh, students are going with to-do list app in, in react 
so if you are creating a to do list app and you are expecting that uh, 12 lpa or 15 lpa so it's not a joke okay you have to create some projects which meets with the market level or current market scenarios your tech stack your knowledge will be in that level so that you will crack the interview as well so just just i i want to give you a simple example just imagine that you are a hr and if a student is coming to you and he is saying that, sir i have just created a, a simple landing page a simple to do list app so you, you will give give him a chance because right now in your company because right now you are an H, you are a hr so the market uh, demand is different different things and you are just cre creating a nursery class level uh, project so also it uh, is not very good that you are your projects must be uh, i can say must be in that condition so that hr will imp hr will impress with your projects so create your projects like that uh, build an e-commerce website as well don't go with the management project as well like hotel management college management restaurant management these are outdated things just uh, right now create some different different clones there is uh, different different ott platforms like uh, netflix uh, uh, and uh, also different different uh, uh, you can say social media based application as well youtube whatsapp uh, slack different different things so why don't you go with to create the clone of that specific uh, things so this will create a very good weightage in your resume as well. Apart from this, they are saying uh, your resume evaluation will be done. So many students haven't uh, their resume approval and they are saying that I am not getting referrals. I am in this batch, I am this batch, Newton is not doing good. So these are myth, totally myth. I just want to showcase you. You have to clear a specific minimum criteria for getting the referrals. HR mocks till medium, they are saying. In projects mock, they are also saying medium. And in projects, you have to at least clear three. Uh, you have to create three projects. The first one is the HTML by default, JS and React. So these are the criteria. First, fulfill the criteria. If you have already fulfilled, then at least check once that uh, all the criteria is completed or not. If your resume is not evaluated, try to uh, complete it as soon as possible. And uh, also, if you complete all the criteria then might be possible you are getting the referrals as well so this is about this uh, all the things in this video that uh, i mentioned you so keep uh, studying on the on this specific task and uh, definitely you will get the referrals so no doubt but uh, please clear the criteria and wait for your turn as well so thank you so much guys for watching this video keep learning bye bye take care if you have any queries or anything then then comment it out in the youtube comment section if i will free and my team will be free then definitely we will respond to you as soon as possible thank you so much bye bye